morning everybody and welcome to vlogmas day four i am joined with my lovely little cat bentley <laughs> so he's just had his breakfast misty has gone upstairs and um, back onto our bed when um stuart's just getting up now <laughs> so um yeah today we are going to be doing some food shopping just you know general food shopping just for the week so we're going to do that very soon and then when we come back we'll get all the Christmas decorations down from the loft hey why don't they yes you like the Christmas decorations and <laughs> and then we can get decorating so um yes I need to open up my number seven advent calendar Ooh, which is down here so number seven yes I know, Bentley, it's impressive. And um, then if I open it out, so you're going to help me find number four. So there we go. So we are, oh, sorry, nearly, <laughs> nearly hit him around the face. Um, no, that's number nine, Bentley. Um, so number four is, number four is here. And we're jolly good time there, aren't you? Uh, so let's have a look and see what is in number four. Oh, what could it be, Bentley? It be uh, so let's have a look oh oh nice we have got an eyeshadow palette I'm loving that it's all makeup so far I think there is um, some actual skincare stuff in there as well maybe that comes a little bit later but it is an eyeshadow palette in these beautiful colors and if you'd seen the um eyeshadows that I picked up from my friend who does the Tropic skincare. They're similar colours and that is just what I like to wear. I did actually yesterday my eyeshadow brush, I did use that this morning. Um, I still like the whole finger sort of <laughs> dabbing um, thing but it was quite nice using a brush. Um, but yes, aren't they lovely? And you get three full sized ones there. Really, really pretty. And this is the Warm Suede Trio Eyeshadows. So I will wear those tomorrow, I think. So yeah, that is a lovely day four. Um, I'm also wearing my um, jumper that I bought from Primark the other day. And yeah, it's really nice and soft. Really like how it fits. It's, um, I'll just quickly stand up so you can kind of see it in case anyone's interested. It's not a, it's not a me made, but hey ho. Um, but yeah, it's kind of quite um, sort of baggy. It was a men's size small. Um, but I like kind of rolling up the sleeves a little bit and I like the neck as well. It's kind of, it's not tight, but it kind of stands up a little bit. So. I'm actually really, really happy with that. So I am going to finish off my tea and then, uh, yes, go out food shopping. And then I will speak to you a little bit later on. Maybe um, I'll pop you in the corner, maybe when we're doing the um, Christmas tree um, putting up. <laughs> so I'll see you a bit later.
Okay, so the Christmas tree is done. I forgot to show you that I did actually put uh, the star on top of the tree and we've put some chocolates and things on there as well. Um, we've also done some other decorations, so like by the fireplace, it's where like our advent stuff is. Um, we do have some lights kind of just, you see just up here, but we haven't dropped them yet because we've got um, uh, the uh, Sky Internet man coming tomorrow. I can hear a cat playing with ball ball. <sighs> Didn't take too long, did it? Um, so, <laughs> uh, yeah, so you might not have seen uh, Misty actually helping. Bentley uh, very much likes to help with the Christmas tree. Misty um, is just fast asleep. Bentley! I oh, don't know if you can hear him. It's naughty. I'm going to have to raise the ball balls. Um, yes, Misty fast asleep. Can't even see her little face, can you? But uh, she's right here. Yeah, you can see her little ear. But yeah, she is absolutely fast asleep. She's not getting up for anyone. So sorry if my hair's a bit dishevelled and my nose is a bit red. Um, we've just been outside doing decorations as well. So when it gets dark, I will show you those at some point too. Right, so I better move some ball balls, Bentley. Better move some, move some ball balls slightly higher up because this is normally the test. We usually don't put ball balls kind of when you see it's quite plain near there, so you might need to just raise a few of them up. Um, so, yes, I will catch you a little bit later. So I have just finished dinner. Whew, I am so full. Um, I am a bit guilty of doing very large portions. 
um some of my friends um will say when they come around for dinner that um, oh yes that's a michelle size portion i just love to feed <laughs> and uh, yeah on that dinner we also had an extra little plate more vegetables and a couple more potatoes um which all went so Stuart and I were absolutely starving from, you know, doing all of the Christmas decorations and stuff. And uh, yeah, we only had a, a light lunch anyway. But yeah, I love Sunday dinner to just be a massive, warm, cosy dinner. So that was absolutely yummy. <laughs> So I've come up to the sewing room to do my Beyond the Pink Door advent calendar. Now, usually on a Sunday, I will watch um, Beyond the Pink Door um, live on a Sunday. She does it at seven o'clock every Sunday. But unfortunately, I was actually cooking at the time and then I was eating and then we were kind of like watching the football and everything. And also, I realised I haven't opened my advent calendar yet. And I just thought just in case there were kind of any spoilers when I was watching it. Um, so unfortunately, I didn't actually watch it. Um, but what I will do is I'll probably try and catch up with it at some point, because if I do miss it, I do like to have a little look through and see what fabrics Andrea has, because, yeah, I love, love, love her website. So let's have a look and see what is inside the advent calendar. So we are on day number four. Find number four. Number four. Oh, it's a little one. Number four. And we have got, oh, we've got a little gingerbread man sitting in a little cup of uh, hot chocolate. Really, really sweet. So let's have a look and see what is inside. Oh, it's quite tightly wrapped. Let's see what it is. We have got, oh, how cute. Oh, I've seen these. These um, are little seam um, gauges that you can pop on your machine and they're like magnetic. Oh, that's brilliant. Sorry, I've just done that on my machine. <laughs> but yeah, that's brilliant. And it's a little sewing machine. That's really good. So yeah, you pop it on and then you can kind of use it as a guide um, to kind of get your seam allowances and everything that's really really nice so pleased with that that's a great little thing thank you so much andrea if you're watching that's brilliant so that is another day over with so yeah it's sunday so i've got work tomorrow fun um <laughs> so um yeah i will um probably speak to you in the morning and then when i get home i don't really know how much i'm going to really be able to film um but I haven't actually done any sewing since Vlogmas has started and we're already on day four, which is over. So I really need to get sewing at some point. I've still got a project which I was meant to do in November that I still haven't finished. Well, actually two projects, one I'm halfway through and the other one I didn't even start. So <laughs> I'm so far behind with my sewing. So what I might do is I might pop that one on hold and then maybe get going on some of my gifts because, yeah, I just want to get those out of the way and done with because stuff for myself, you know, I've got no deadline for. So, yeah, I might try and do a little bit of sewing maybe, um, maybe tomorrow. We will see. Let's just see where the day takes us. <laughs> OK, well, I hope you enjoyed today and yes, I will speak to you tomorrow. Bye.